Oh God, what is happening? Hold on a second. Where is like, hold on. Why is this like, look at how dark this is, bro. What happened? Hello? Oh, thank you. Thank you for that. Yeah, I was in a rush to get started today. So I've been, uh, yeah, I was, <coughs> I didn't actually set up the camera correctly today. Oh God, it's so high up. So yes, hello, welcome back. I'm assuming that you guys have sound. Hopefully everybody has sound right now because uh, I didn't have a chance to really do any checking or anything, but I see the monitors. I just, I can't hear anything except for like, like my game or whatever. It's really annoying right now. I really should have, uh, <laughs> I should have prepared a little bit more for this stream, but hey, I was busy all day. Busy, busy making that bread and all that. I don't know if any of you guys were uh, working outside today in this heat it was just terrible it was like it was i was like literally cooking like that was literally why jesus changed his middle name to fucking it was ridiculous out there and that being said i couldn't think of a more cathartic experience uh after all of that than to uh to play more mist because as we all know nothing's more relaxing than screaming at a train for having what over tw look at this look at this this is what we were doing the other day Ah, uh, dude. Okay, where do where do we start? Where do we start? So we were on this train the other day, and this was like a like three hours or or something. It took me a long time to get through this, and then I had to like blindly follow through this maze because I never clued in that. And there's the end right there. I never clued in that I was actually supposed to like learn from the audio cues, which was a theme uh, for that one, but. Uh, I, I really just didn't. So that was kind of brutal. And so I ended up just kind of blindly feeling around, um, which is, it's, it, I, I had, I had the mentality of the, um, oh, welcome to the stream. I see we have another viewer. Uh, I had the mentality of like the, the Minotaur maze where it's like, oh, you just follow the left wall. That's the solution to the puzzle. Completely negating that the entire world was about, uh, sound the whole time. So that was very smart of me. Uh, that was that was the big brain moment of Jimmy Neutron for sure. Um, I'm sure I'm sure we're gonna fare better today. Uh, but I mean, we've been doing pretty good considering the fact that we actually like. Um, I only really needed to like get help from like any outside help like twice, like from chat or a guide. In my opinion, in my opinion, maybe there's a time that I forgot, but. I feel like that's all that happened. So let's, um, I feel like that's what it is. I feel like it. We'll see. We'll see. Anyway, back to mist. Gonna, it's gonna do it. We get it! We get it! God damn. Okay. Boom, I got the new setup. I got the fresh follow from Jello is Yum. Thank you so much for following Jello is Yum. Damn, if only you, you followed an hour ago, if only you followed during the stream, there's a little animation that plays. You should unfollow and then follow again, that's a good idea. You know, gotta use that Streamlabs. Except I can't hear it now, because my Streamlabs is busted, but it, will, it should still happen on the stream, that'd be pretty based. You know how it is. Hey, I just realized I can't see my stream preview. That kind of matters. Hello? 
Hello. Pop out the stream preview. Oh. Oh. Oh, oh. Oh, no. I was so proud of my layout. And, uh, oh, cancel changes. Okay. Okay, fine. But I can't see. That, that completely negates the whole point of everything that I was trying to do. Oh, well. Uh, I'm just going to go back to the to the Streamlabs chat and just monitor chat like a normal person. Or, uh, you know what? I'm going to go back to the stream manager. Frick it, man. I'm just blind. I can't, like, I'm, I'm just trying to find a solution to have a little monitor where I can see everything. And it's like, I either got to take some elements or I got to leave some elements. Um, it's like, oh, I can't see the stream, but now I can see my activity feed and the chat. Um, oh, you can kind of see it. I can kind of see it if I turn it sideways. Oh God. Oh God. That's, that's horrible. Come on. Come on. You gotta be kidding me, bro. Well, you know what? I'll do there. I can barely see the screen. It's a pixel. It's one pixel. We got it. We got it. We're winning now. This is what, this is what winning actually looks like. So I don't know how much time we're going to have today, um, considering that I had to start super late because I'm, I'm a busy boy. I was working. I was working hard. Ah, yes. And we have appeared in the new book. So I, I am going to go through the convoluted rail again to get the other page just so I can see what the other brother has to say because I want to see all the video clips. So I will speed run through that part. At some point, we got the map, so it shouldn't take too long, but obviously we can't do anything until we figure out this this island. Um, I think this one had to do with constellations, but I don't know if we're going to continue that theme. Because now, like, now I realize what the formula is after last round. Um, <coughs> um, oh, and now I lose my, uh, I lose my monitor. Okay, well, there goes that idea. I will just have to, uh, I don't know. I'm just going to do this for now, I guess. Damn. Stream manager? Hey. Yeah, no, that's weird. Okay. Well, hopefully the screen doesn't turn off on me this time. Anyway. Um, yeah, so I realized the formula. Like, like, last time I couldn't figure out, like, what I was supposed to do. I just accidentally popped into one of these books. Interesting. What am I doing? Um, but yeah, no, like the formula of these books, like, seems to be that, like, you go to the library after each world that you go to, and then you just open up the new book, and then that will give you hints about what puzzle you need to do on the main island to get into the mini world. I get it now. I just, like, I didn't clue in until the second world now, but I think we're, we're firing on all cylinders now. I'm just gonna check out this, uh this lighthouse area and just see what's up. Um, also, yeah, I want to hear more about the crazy manic brother, Agnar, because, uh, like, yeah, Cirrus seems evil, but Agnar seems to have, like, dead bodies in his chest, in his, like, secret, in his secret room that he has in that one world, which is kind of really creepy. And I don't know if it's his, like, I'm just assuming, like, it's just, I don't know. I don't know if it's associated with him at all, but I just don't, I don't really, uh, you know, I just don't trust the guy. Oh, no. Bruh. Um, well, that's obviously what that's for. Okay. Cool. Well, at least I know that my stream manager is working. That's pretty chill. Well, this is like dark, dark. There's like actually, there has to be a way to like bring light. I bet there's like something up ahead. Okay. Oh, and it's flooded there. Interesting. 
Um. Oh. Oh, yeah, that's, that's what's going on there. It's like completely flooded in. <coughs> Whoa. Let's see what we can see. Oh, yeah. We got numbers in degrees, so we have to find something that uh, that is associated with this. That seems that seems significant. Okay, maybe not. Oh no, that's I thought there was another one up there. Hmm. This this nineties music is really sick. I don't wanna like go back down the plank just yet because I wanna hear this tune. But I feel like there's nothing we can really do at this point up here, so... What I'm gonna do is go back to that weird generator thing, but I think I saw a crate up here? Can I walk up to that? In any way, is there any way for me to walk over there? I don't think so. I swear to god, if this- if I find out later and we get stuck and I have to go on a guide and it's like, Oh, you have to click on this pixel, I will lose my mind. Oh, baton. Oh no, that's just a rivet. Yeah, okay, so that's what we're looking at. We're looking at like a flooded in cavern, that makes more sense. Okay, did I miss anything here? Obviously, like, we can't do anything with this key and this chain. And like, we can't even get down here, and like, it like, oh, do we have no water in here now? We drained a bunch of stuff before, and now there's no water. Okay. Can I look at the drain? Not really. Okay, there's nothing else down here. Mm. I just don't want to go through it too quick, just in case there's like something that I, I missed. But yeah, okay. So I either need to like break this... I don't know if I have to, like, break this chain or something, or, like, yeah, I think I have to break this chain somehow. But, I don't know, considering that my character can only hold one piece of paper in their hand at a time, I don't think they're strong enough to do that. I don't really, uh, believe in this character too much. I'm just trying to figure out what that actually does. So you can only select one, one at once. You know... Maybe... Did that, did that guy say something about it in the book? Because I was about to chew him out here and say maybe he should have, like, talked less about these random kids or whatever that were hanging out on the island and, uh, tell me what the heck they're... Whatever the heck that is. <coughs> yeah, but based on what we read in the book and how this place looks now, it looks, uh, it looks horrible and deserted. There was like a bunch of people here before. I just don't know what to do with this number, because... Hmm. I wonder if there's anything, like, numbered that I've been missing. Let's see. Is that weird generator thing? No, it's completely separate. Like, I was, I was like, oh, there's a cable running from there. But no, this is, it's not like the spaceship. Like, this is its own kind of thing just sitting off here. 
not connected to anything. <clears throat> hmm. Whoa! What, what did I do to do that? What did I do to do that? Okay. Sure. Okay. Man, that's the sound you make when you like blow bubbles into your milk with a straw. That's what they're doing right now. <laughs> that's absolutely what's happening. Bruh. Ain't no way, bro. Dude, this sounds foul. We're, I don't know if we want to be here right now. Oh, God. Bro, it is pitch black. Oh. This is like really cursed. What's that? Um. Oh shit, my camera's freaking autofocus is still autofocusing. God, turn that shit off. Fuck autofocus. I'm like way up here too, like I gotta like chill out with the uh... There we go. Yeah, now you can get a good angle of me absorbing the sound of this diarrhea. <laughs> God damn. I think I'll be back. I think that that's what I'm going to be. Yeah. Um. Okay. Um. Oh. Oh! 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 I know what it does now. I know what it does now. Big brain, big brain. Okay, uh, I'm gonna do this. Yes! Hello. Holy fuck, this is scary. I just... Ooh. Is this like... His secret dunny house? <laughs> hidden in the... In this age that he wrote? Oh yeah. Is this, um... No, this looks like, uh, Kath like something that Catherine would own. I'm just trying to think, like, if it is one of the Dunny family members, like, whose room would this be? It might be, like, Catherine or Cirrus. Oh. I mean, the red paper is here. It does seem like a place that Cirrus would be. Um... Okay, we know that the red paper is there. We have to find Agnar's paper. Figure out how to w get off this world. Basically, I'm just trying to, like, get these papers. And, um... You know, just, uh, get these papers back at the book so that we can go back to the old world that we were at yesterday.
Is this not flooded? No, it's still flooded. What does this change? I don't know what the third one does. Damn, bro. Damn, bro! Seriously, what, what, what does this do? I didn't know you can turn it off. That's a new state. Okay. This is gonna be flooded, yeah. Can I do anything now that this is wet? Nope. Okay, let's go over here. Nope, it's still flooded. So... That's weird that it would change... The water for that, but nothing else. Like, just these two spots, just just the boat and the lighthouse, it changes the water for it and nothing else? No way, right? Hmm. Yeah. There's not really much to this island. It's really small. So, okay. Just double check here. Hmm. Well, this got drained again. I wonder if Agnar is... Oh. That's an interesting... New angle, I don't think I was there before. Hmm. I wonder what that's all about. Hmm. Nothing new. Oh. What was... No, that's just like a lamp. Man, we got two things with a keyhole. Um... We need to fill this up with water. That's what we gotta do. That's the puzzle. Big brain. Fill that shit up, bro. Fill it up the deck. Fill it up with that good good, bro. I, I thought that I was going to fill the chest with water, but I realized what happened. So before, this chest was full of water, and it was sunk to the bottom of this lighthouse. And then I went to the generator. I, I basically opened the tap. I drained the water. That's what that was before. Then because it was full of air, and then I sealed it back shut. Now that I sealed it back shut, it flows to the surface because it's buoyant. Very cool. Big brain. Big brain. And another... Wow. Okay, here we go. Uh -huh. Okay. I feel like we're making really speedy progress on this uh, on this part of the map already, and I'm in like full heat stroke mode here too, which is like just wild. Like I'm actually off to the races here. Sorry, I'm just um, you know, I have some coffee beans grinding up here. Mm -hmm. This is oh. What did I do? Oh. Wow. 
Wow, we're, we're pretty juiced there. I think we're pretty juiced. Okay. Big juice. Nice. Um... Hmm. There's, I don't think there's, do I just look at it? What is this connected to? This runs to a wire outside, uh, over there somewhere. Are we juiced though? We're fully juiced. I don't think you can get more juice than that. Okay. Let's see. We got. Oh, look at that. We got lights and shit. Like, fuck yeah, bro. Okay. Yeah, very good. So his brother's bet. The, the brother's chamber must be. Just like over yonder here. Thank you. Thank you. Look at that. Look at that. Dude, we're just. Fl Ain't no way, bro. Last time he had corpses and now he has fucking this. Like he's like big buck hunting for fucking people, bro. Why would you make a lamp like this, my guy? Yeah, sure. Well, we got both pages. Well, I'll start carrying this one around and then we'll come back for the red one since the travel time is definitely not long for this world. Um, hello? This guy is like cracked out, my guy. Oh. I can't look at these close up. There's a lot of, uh, I guess these are different uh, ages that they've written into books. If I had to guess. Why does the one brother, he has so much wealth, and the other brother is, like, living in, like, filth? Like, always. Well, that solves that. So now I'm just wondering, how the hell do we get off this place now? Because... We completed our objective. We got what we, we got what we came here for. What is this? Like I said, we're flying today, guys. Whoa. This looks like degrees. This looks like that could be what that is. That looks like a CCTV camera. Hey, you know that other... Is this the place that was, uh... This wasn't the place that we were in before that sounded like... Like, uh, gurgling diarrhea, was it? Wow, so that connects the two rooms, okay. 
Yeah. I bet that the way out is like over here or some something. It's good to know that compass is there though. Still no power? What's going on down here? Man, I bet the mist book is down here, bro. I need to get a better view. Hmm. I thought power would run there, you know? How are we doing for electricity, bro? Oh, gotta gotta crank this John. I wonder if the telescope relates to that compass downstairs at all. Uh. Yeah, see it's all lit up, and then it's just pitch black down here. So maybe I can't get the... Maybe there's a different way to get the lights on. Back to that compass strip and see if I can find that detail. Because the fact that we cranked that lighthouse thing, I feel like this is like one of the last areas that we need to know about. What happened? Bro, we were cranked. A naff ass puzzle. That does the same thing. Okay, I thought it was a time release, but I think that I just screwed it up. Let's see, why is it so blue? Is it because I have the blue page? 
Now I'm curious. I'm just going to grab the rib page and do the same thing. I just don't know if the, I don't know if it, the, that's just like a backup light that just happens to be blue, but, you know, maybe. This generator is kind of like degrees, and so is the compass, and so is the telescope. Is this going down on its own? Mmm! I hate this thing! Okay, so maybe it is just a time crank thing. I thought that it might just be a position that the generator might have to be in. See, I don't know what does that. I think it might be a different, I think each one of those little dots might be like a button or something like that, so I'm just gonna, I'm just gonna see. Like, bro. Somebody tells me it makes no difference what page we have, which means I should probably just swap pages again before I forget. That has to be something. Like, I have to be onto something with that logic. Like, I swear to god. User maps. This is also an angular thing. Huh. Might just be an audit, like just some oddity that this guy has on his uh, dresser for no reason. Why does he have, like, just bottles of poison? I mean, that's all this is. This is, but they're, like, multiple different kinds. Like, he needs to, like, poison people in different ways. Like, wow, what a really good guy that we're helping out here right now. Okay.
It's as soon as I click on that. <sighs> Normally there's like a letter in this, in the age too that we're in, so I'm hoping that we hear like a letter from one of the brothers to the other, something that might shed some more light on this situation, but even the last one of him complaining about his brother hoarding wealth, that had nothing to do with the puzzle. Also, how can you hoard wealth if you can just, like, write more wealth by making another book? So I think that's when I fail a puzzle it does that. So there has to be a certain thing that I'm hitting there. Like, I think that's a failsafe for a puzzle. So let's see if there's anything significant. If zero is north on the compass, right? Right? Yeah, I'm right. I'm right. I think this is what we're doing here. I like this music. Uh, I need a new piece of paper. Fuck. Fuck right off. Come on. Come on. Bro. Thank you. Pizza paper. Okay. I'm gonna draw a compass here. Got all the angles, all the degrees. So I think it's either a specific piece of land because, like, the book was talking about nearby islands and all that. So... These headphones, bro. I need, I need to buy new headphones. It's so expensive. <laughs> okay, cool. Yeah, I had to, like, recalibrate them. They were, like, buzzing in my ear. It's really annoying. Um, let's see. I don't think 180 works. I was thinking at first it'd be like, oh, what's a piece of land? And then... Like that? I don't know. Hmm. I was like, oh, if I find a piece of land, maybe it's some teleporter. So if I angle it the right thing, then... Yeah, but I don't think so. 230. It's like all of these kind of vaguely point to... What's this? So it's the top of the lighthouse. Um... I don't think that's anything, though. Hmm. I might need a guide. I'm not ready to pull the plug just yet, but I gotta double check, because I feel like this has to be associated with that thing downstairs. I feel like there's probably a certain order that I have to press those buttons. Oh. Which reminds me, I should probably count the amount of buttons that there are so I can write it on my compass because right now drawing this circle doesn't help me at all. Do we have to do the crank though? Can the puzzle just... 
Can this thing just be on or be a switch or something? Or I don't know. We're going to demonstrate our full motion graphics to the fullest extent humanly possible. You cannot see the border right here at all where the crank starts. Okay. That's a lot of circles, bro. That's a lot of circles. I'm gonna take a 30 second uh, coffee break here. Just a second. I'm gonna draw this as well. Uh, so just one second. Good. We're, we're, we're firing on all the cylinders. Okay. Yeah, I lied. I didn't draw on the compass yet. Is this seriously like... Ain't no way this is what this is. I'm gonna call this zero. This is 180. Sussy. Talk in a Canadian accent? <laughs> What's a Canadian accent? Oh, like Newfoundland. Ain't no way. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight to ninety. One, two, three. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. And then ninety is eight. Ninety is eight. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. One, two, three, 
four, five, six, seven. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Okay, so we got these dots. I'm assuming. Yeah. So I'm assuming that there has to be a certain combination or something that will not make this annoying alarm blare in my ears. Okay, um, I'm just trying to see if there's a pattern that I can see in the imagery that might make me think that there's a, an, a, an order to all of this. Like maybe the peaks of the mountains are the numbers or something like that, because that, like that's two, that's no. No. So that's obviously not what that is. One, two, yeah, I mean, I mean. Uh, well, you know what? Why don't I just throw in whatever whatever the lighthouse is, and then we'll call it, and then, like, I'll look at a guide if that's not it. Because, like, I really, like, I don't know, like that, it's kind of like, so that's a little sussy. It's a little sussy. Um, shit. I don't know how to do math here. So am I going to have to, like, figure out what the hell 80 is on this freaking chart and correlate it to a number? Because I don't know how to freaking divide freaking... Ah, uh, no way. No way the game's going to make me do this. Ain't no way, bro. That can't be it. I might have to look at the guide. I think I might have to look at the guide. Um, 80... And, yeah, I don't know. And there's 135 right here that this perfectly lines up with and looks like something. Because, I mean, look. Look. What the hell is 135? Okay, hold on. I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to close my activity feed. I cannot see you guys right now. I have to freaking do this. 180 plus, you're going to hate this, 90. 270. 270. That's right. I do not know maths. I need a calculator. Um, okay. So that's 270. That's 130. And that's about right over. Uh, look. Yeah, okay. I don't know. I don't see any patterns. I'm going to see... I feel like we're close. I feel like we're close, which is what, what kind of makes checking the guide here kind of sad, but we're going to do it. Um, let's see. Let's see. Let's see what the guide says. <clears throat> I can't believe you would call me sussy. Okay. It says... Wait, I don't even remember what age we're on. This is the... Stone ship age? Yes, 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 yes. So, pump the water out of the tunnels as these two tunnels... At the end of these two tunnels are red and blue pages. Go down the tunnel nearest to the telescope and you'll find half a sheet. You'll find half a sheet of paper. Go down the tunnel nearest to the telescope where you'll find half a sheet of paper. Hmm. Ah! I gotta, I gotta turn that fucking alarm off. It's gonna make my eardrums explode. It's not aesthetic.
Hello, new viewer. I definitely didn't just peek at a guide because I didn't know about a half a sheet of paper somewhere in this hallway that I definitely blew past a million times. That definitely didn't happen at all. Something totally normal and not that happened. Where's this piece of paper? Nearest to the telescope? Ain't no way. Also, why would there be a sheet of paper here? This this would be flooded. It would be flooded. So, like, it would be destroyed. Um... Maybe I read it wrong. Maybe I read... Maybe I read what it said wrong. Um... Oh, is it, maybe it's talking about the room at the end of the tunnel. How is there... I just don't understand how there's a sheet of paper that we miss. Maybe I was too... If it's the one nearest the telescope, it is this room with the skeleton. And that is kind of a, a distracting element, you know? Seeing uh, just this on display. But it's, it's not going to be one of these. This, these are just maps. Yeah. There, oh, there's the half a sheet of paper. Dude, I swear to God, if we go back, if we go back in this stream, if we go back, I swear to God, I went through all of it. I must have, like, misclicked or something. There's no way. I was like, oh, no way. No way. I'm embarrassed. I'm freaking embarrassed. Okay. Marker switch. We will write this all down here. Marker... I'll... The vault is... The island of... Achieved very... a final step. There's two two th. Okay, we got it all written down here.
So, there has to be just like another piece of paper in this guy's room, right? Yeah, I still wonder what that does. If it if that's just a visualizer, that'd be very strange. Hmm. Interesting. Wow. Both of both of these two brothers, I'm assuming that this is their stuff. Like these two guys are really weird. Very creepy guys. Oh, whoa. That's some 3D graphics right there from the 90s. Yep. <laughs> wow. That's crazy. I wonder what that says. Beam. I feel like if I was the character, I would be able to read this and see what that says, and I would want to know. Maybe it's some language we don't know. That doesn't even make any fucking sense. They speak English. Uh, yeah, yeah. Yeah, getting tripped up by a single, uh, getting tripped up by a single, uh, pixel, and, like, misclicking the, the drawer is very annoying. Um, yeah, I, I rushed in here, basically, just thinking that I would find another piece of paper, but I don't see one, so... There's all these crests up here, too. Yeah, I just kind of expected these two to have, like, the same stuff in them. Yeah, see, so like, bro, just close it. So we got this boy, but, like, hmm. That's creepy.
Yeah, I don't know. Like, <clears throat> it was very discouraging to hear that the uh, Riven is going to be harder. I thought it was going to be more intuitive, but I guess I just went crazy. this what is this why do I have an extra key imagine that this is just something that like has to do with nothing and I guess I just have a key for no reason. I might have a key for no reason. Because it disappears out of my hand as soon as I leave. Yeah. Key goes back down there. I use the key to get that key, and then... Key the key, and then... Friggin... 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 I don't know. I don't know, bro. Yeah, no. I think that I can just grab the key from this, and that's it. I just have a key. I don't think it does anything. Okay. Well, we were off to the races in the beginning, and I'm just like... Yeah. I already had to pull up the guide just to find that one piece of paper. This is, this is frustrating, too. You see that box? Yeah, I walk down here, I see that box, and I'm like, oh, what's that box? It's like I want to walk over there and check it out, but I can't. I freaking can't. Yeah. Well, I don't know, Chief. Yeah, Friven is going to be way harder with me more, way more logical leaps. It's like, that's, that's discouraging. Like, immensely so. Oh, uh, those just seal up. Yeah, I think that just seals up when the chamber floods. Mm. Yeah, that's a thing, man. Like, I don't know. 90s point and click puzzles are just like. There's just points with them. Smoked that freaking, um, what's it called? I s like I smoked that last one like pretty good too. Like even though it took me a while to get through the thing, like I don't really, I didn't really pull out much for any help. Um, That's why I don't really want to check the guide twice. Hmm. But, you know, if push comes to shove... Whatever. <clears throat> I just want to progress. I think that's... I think that might be... I think that might be the, the best thing to do. I think that's what's gonna happen here. Let's see. Okay, so what are we supposed to do? Right down what you see, then go to the other tunnel, then halfway down. 
Open the door of the wall. Go to the circular board. The whole board is a button that's a total of 360 degrees. Press the button that's the same as the lighthouse degree. <clears throat> okay. So I was right about the lighthouse. I just really didn't want to do that because that involved figuring... I don't think I need the exact number for it because I just need a light, but like... Then what's the point of half of this book? This must be for a different age or something like that. I don't know. Why is this blinking now? A little late for that. Now you could say, oh, well, it's because he powered on the generator and before it wasn't on, so... But, like... It's not even on. It's not even on. So it's just... It's just... Okay, let's just double check that. Maybe it just ran out of power on my way here. No way it's just blinking randomly on its own now because it... Because it felt like it? Is that what happened? It just felt like blinking at some point? Like, I don't know the threshold that I crossed. Maybe it was discovering that half page. But, like, I don't know the threshold that I crossed that made that just start blinking for no reason. Strange, right? I don't know if I'm the only one. Well, anyway, 130. Uh, let's see, what is that on this? 180, 10, 20, 30, 40, 50, 60, 70, 80. oh shit, it's going to be like a range of these unless I can calculate it, uh, this is the worst, okay, 130, So this must be 95, 100, 110, or 115, no, 100, fuck, 95, 100, 105, 110, 15, 20, 25, 30. That doesn't work. That does not work. 90, 100. 110. Because this is 135. 90, 100, 110, 120, 130. Like. So it might be that one. It might be. The fourth button to the right of the 180. These lights are just stuck on now. Unless I hit the wrong one here, I guess. So I think it's this. to hit the wrong button.
Now, well, I could partially brute force it. It might be faster than trying to, like, do big math. Because I'm, I'm not good at math. Fuck off. Come on. Come on! Nine. I have an idea. I think I might understand how the compass corresponds with the telescope a little bit more. That's, that's, that is frustrating though that I have no idea what made the lighthouse actually light up. Like I really wanted to discover that on my own and I like had no idea how. Because I swear, we looked at the lighthouse last time and it wasn't blinking. And I don't know. I. Yeah, I don't know. I don't know. Boom. 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 Mm. Oh, yeah, right. I have to check the ship first. Uh. Hello. That's why I came up here. That would have been quicker to go the other way. Dumb. I can just count it. I can just fucking count it. <laughs> it should have just been blinking the whole time. I'm mad at that. I'm very mad. I'm upset he's spaghetti. Um, okay. So that's 95. This is 100. Ninety-five, a hundred, a hundred and five, hundred and ten, hundred and fifteen, hundred and twenty, hundred and twenty-five, hundred and thirty. Yeah, it doesn't make too much sense. Is 50, 60, 70, 80. Because if I just count it, I can't just count it. These, these aren't like intervals of five. It's like something else. I might just brute force it. I'm at that point. I'm like, whatever. Like, I understand the solution of the puzzle is that I'm supposed to figure out the degrees, but like... <laughs> I'm 
you know. Yeah. It's... I was gonna say it's not as bad as the rail puzzle, but I think it's a little worse. The rail puzzle, like, I understood, and even if I didn't fully understand it, I could still complete it, but, like, this is just, like, yeah. So I'm hoping that this that this thing makes a different noise, or else we're really hooped. Um, I don't know if I really have to crank this. I guess so. I think it just resets the freaking thing. This is fun. Imagine if we go all the way to 90 now, and it's just like... <laughs> and I just get the same result because I'd have to actually go and check every time, then I'd be like, okay. Guide. generator is like I get that they have to do it so that like to discourage like just people just going click 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 but hmm like I know I'm going in like the total opposite direction that I should be but like I don't even think I have to fill it up to full. I think I can just like keep coming back down here after one little crank. I don't even think I have to ro rotate it once. Just like a little touch. So how does this translate to 135? Is that half of 90 and 180? Is that is that what that is? Isn't it crazy that math was one of my strongest subjects and I was like a fucking um, honor student and this is the shit that goes on? Like, I could not do the arithmetic. That would have just made me hit the button immediately. Okay, like I said, I bet the miss book is down there, so we're gonna take a quick recess. A uh, short little uh, coffee break, you know how they- uh, Yeah, yeah, you know what I'm talking about. Anyway, let's-
Okay, so since <clears throat> since nobody is tuning in live, I just wanted to say a, a quick um, apology to all the viewers who are, um, oh yeah, I should probably do what I was going to say I was going to do. Yeah, um, I want to do a little quick apology because I, uh, I just realized that I could be splitting these clips so that you don't have to see the we'll be right back, you can just like skip through it in the VOD but you had to do that manually because I have not been splitting my clips. So that is my fault. My fault. I am sorry, VOD viewers, which is literally all of you right now. Um, <clears throat> Cause yeah, this stream is gonna be dead for a while. But you know, you know how it is. I'm just trying to play Miss Bro. Oh yeah, baby. We got the blue page. We'll come back for the red guy in a sec. <coughs> yeah, hated the compass puzzle. Like, hated the part where I couldn't see the uh, the lighthouse, uh, like, blinking at first, so, like, there was no significance to anything in the view. And then I just assumed the lighthouse, because it lined up perfectly, and it was, like, a perfect point, and I'm like, okay. But then it blinked later, and I'm like, well, oh, what made that blink? Then combined with the fact that it's like, okay, do I have to do, like, some, some math here to figure out the freaking angle when I can just, like, run back and forth and brute force it? And you can do that, but then the game punishes you, um, yeah, yeah, I don't know, I, I kind of liked the other world from yesterday a little bit more, because even though that puzzle took longer, and I was, like, yelling at it, I was having fun, because I was like, I know what I'm doing, but it was very much, um, it was, I was very much at a loss for that whole last part of the section, which is a shame, because, all the other puzzles I figured out, so... So anyway, buddy, let's see what you have to say. Do we rescue you, or do we rescue your brother? Or... Is the game gonna give us that third option that I've heard about? Bring more. Well, I ask of you. Long. It's so long since my brother, Cyrus, wrongfully imprisoned me within this book. Stupid schemes. Pretty speech. Greed, which is endless. Obvious to you. He's done evil and he has destroyed all before. Do not bring the red pages to him. Not let him trip you. He tripped our father. Hideously murdered our father. He'll trick you. This is very, um... To me. Listen, you must obey me. Ages are my only hope. You must help me. You must help me. Help me. 
So, like that... <clears throat> so he tricked the father, too. So he's saying that he imprisoned his father as well? Um, big if true. Big if true. Um, but that red book, though. I just don't remember from yesterday. So, I guess, VOD viewers, you can skip ahead, but I need to know. This guy does seem like a manipulator. And the other guy does seem more like he's frantically. See, he could. It, it, it really could be that he's talking about his brother when he says the thirst for destruction is nigh. I could see this guy being a manipulator, but I could see the other guy being a murderer. Um, cause like he has, I don't know, man, just the body, just the bot, the body is the big part. <clears throat> okay. We're going back in here. Which means that we have to take the long commute all the way back. <clears throat> Hmm. Which means I should probably split the clip for the VOD here, for sure. Because <laughs> this is, uh, this is gonna be filler. Bruh, but by now the player would have under proven to the game that they understood the puzzle. Do we, like, I don't know, man. I don't know. Does the game think we beat the puzzle yet? Jesus. Fuck that. Fuck that. Okay. Let's see if we can, uh... If we can get a better picture of what's going on now. Now that we're back. Oh, my friend. Bring in the blue page. 
Tokyo. <laughs> I see. Convinced that Cirrus is guilty. Pray, do not release him. He will destroy me just as he can. Innocent bystander. I've been wrongly tricked. No prison me. You have observed his unbridled lust for riches! Yeah, I saw that. The remaining worlds. Do some plot. It was almost perfect! Final blow to the father. He tricked him into believing that it was I who was the murderer. I didn't murder father. Bring me the remaining. Please. Liar. What in a liar? Must not be free. What am I? The main blue pages from the last age of mist. I must be free. Must free me. I cannot bear it here for eternity. Free me. The Last Age of Mist. So that sounds like each one of them just needs one more page to be released. Um, I wonder, like, like, at first glance... Like, I know that the father... Like, I know there's a third option. And there has to be a way, a way to interact with this father guy. But, like... Yeah, I, like... So far, like, like with what, like, I'm given, I'm, like... I would go with probably the Red Book guy. Just because I feel like this guy would, like, gnaw my face off. The first chance he gets. That's my opinion. Anyway, um, that was the stream for today. I think that that's where we're going to leave it off because, honestly, um, just doing that commute and then also, uh, like, also just the fact that it was basically, like, the same kind of redundancy. This one was pretty good, except for, once again, the elevator that I got totally tripped up on, but, I mean, the game is doing its best to be visually, like, honestly, like, I give it, I give this puzzle a break, absolutely. I absolutely give this puzzle a break, because it's, like, <clears throat> how are they going to depict, like, a countdown timer? Like, I feel like they could have maybe added more visual indicators or something, some more lights or something to do a countdown, but I understand they're working with limited space, but... So that's why, like, I, 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 I give that more of a break, but, like, this puzzle with the commute, that could have been, like, 60% as long, for sure, for sure, and, um, yeah, the other one, what was the other one again? I don't know, it was somewhere, my brain's fried, it's been, uh, it's been a long day with, uh, with work, but, you know, it was good, it was a good day for sure. Um, what was I gonna say? Yeah. But, like, so far so good. We still have the tree age, or whatever, the, the next age with the trees in it. Um, I think that's gonna be... I think that's all the ages that we have left. Because, yeah, the, uh, the dock here, um, with all this, um, I just wasn't a fan of this age. It just, like, um, I don't know. It's it's similar redundancy done in a more annoying feeling way, I think, in terms of, like, player feedback. Um, and then, like, I don't know. Like, that half a piece of paper, I don't know why the guide is asking me to have a half a piece of paper. I'm assuming because there's going to be another half a piece of paper somewhere else, but, like, I don't know. Either way, I didn't need that. I did not need that. <laughs> um, 
you know, that probably is going to have maybe something to do with releasing the father or something like that. Um, but yeah, it, like, that's the thing though, is like, I think maybe finding the piece of paper is the thing that made the lighthouse light up, which is really weird. And it, it lights up independently of power. So it's like the game really wanted me to get that piece of paper, but once again, I missed it on a shelf because it's once again, really hard to click on. So yeah, go figure. I was just kind of annoyed with that. Um, yeah. Shelf controls, man. Mist has a 0 out of 10 shelf controls, but I give the puzzles an 8... 8.5 out of 10 so far. Most of them are pretty good, but a couple of them are just like, okay, this is 90s convoluted. You know, which is not bad. I mean, that, that just goes to show this game has aged well. Like, there's a lot of 90s point-and-click adventure games that have gone, like like just like 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 there were games that came out at the same year as this that like would make way bigger logical leaps for basically no reason other than just to make the game long uh or to, like to pad time or whatever which this game does but it's weird though it's weird that like with riven they would want to ramp it up with the difficulty um even though it's like it's so many discs so it's like a bigger world so there's a lot more to there's a lot more to look at, so I just don't know why they would want to make the puzzles more convoluted as a result. Like, you don't need to pad out more time than the game's already going to be huge. So, I don't know. I don't know what happened, but, um, I mean, we'll, we'll, like, from what I've heard, it was only one puzzle in Riven that was kind of, like, brutal like that, but who knows? Maybe, maybe the whole thing is kind of ramped up like that. We'll see. Um... That being said, though, like, the story in this game, like, absolutely 10 out of 10, for sure compelling. Um, I do like this lore of just, like, these people writing books and stuff. I feel like this is very, very 90s fantasy. Like, I love it. Um, yeah. But some of those puzzles, man, made me knock down my rating. But for what it is... And even, even this, even this got fixed in the remake, so, you know, I, ca I, I should have known that there was going to be less quality of life coming into this, but like, you know, you know, anyway, I'll catch you on the next one. We got, yeah, like I said, I'm probably going to need, um, a bit of a break after uh, uh what's it called after all these uh point and click adventure games because i just feel like it's like ex it's exhausting just to do these puzzle games um that's why i'm gonna be really happy just to be switching things up with metro um standard shooter game with a really good story i think that's gonna be a good refresher so it did happen i did get the miss burnout we weren't burnt out uh, before, but I don't know. Just uh, that long rail puzzle combined with that compass puzzle, and then like just like I don't know the, the tower thing. That, that that was a bit of a stretch. Where I'm just like, what? Like, what's the logic here? This is like escape room logic or whatever. I'm like, okay, okay, sure. <laughs> um, yeah. Yeah, th that's that's kind of where I am with that. But anyway, um, yeah. Here, uh, thanks for joining on the stream. Uh, I guess most of you who are going to be watching this are going to be looking at the VOD. So thank you for watching. Um, and yeah, check out this uh, this queue that we have here. I'm pretty, yeah, I'm pretty I'm pretty excited to uh, like obviously like we're committing to it. We're beating it. I'm not allowed to play anything else until this is done. And then the Metro. I have never been more excited to play Metro. <laughs> okay, I'm getting the fuck out of here. I'm gonna, I'm gonna order takeout because you know what? I had a good day at work. Fuck it.